Oh, what's going on over zero? Welcome back to some more Planet Crafter. Today we are, hopefully we're gonna hit the high road and get out of here. We're gonna see what happens. We're gonna check out the ending, hopefully, of the Planet Crafter. Hopefully you're all having an exciting day. I'm having a wonderful day. I uh, can't complain too much. Getting over all the illnesses is fantastic. But yes, today, without further ado, let's get into it. So let me explain to you kind of what I did and what happened here. Um, make sure you have your uh, messages ready to go. And what I did is I actually went to previous locations and I had messages from wardens. Well, I didn't have all of them um, in here. I had read them all pre previously, but they weren't all in here. So I went back and I just clicked on the tablets. So this was the last message I had in the last video. So I went to the, I think I went into the, the underground, the pink area where the ship was and there was uh, three other messages there. I just clicked on them, read them. I've already read these before, but in having those then they showed up here and once i clicked them all through here i got another message from sentinel corp now i don't know if that's related or not but uh planet crafter congratulations our sensors indicate you have successfully terraformed your assigned planet however our monitoring indicates that our planet uh that your planet has an anomaly that prevents us from colonizing it you must destroy this anomaly before uh, using the departure platform so our ships can extract you. Please receive this recipe. Now, I did get this. However, I also did just hit 5.5 at the time. So I don't know if maybe it's triggered by hitting 5.5. Maybe, just maybe, this is my thinking, is maybe you unlock the ability at 5, at the, uh, the, the terraformation index of 5. However they expect you to kind of like go around and explore do things do things do stuff trying to figure it out and then once this hits 5.5 it sends a message saying hey here is what you need because what i got was the ability to make explosives um somewhere where is it at where's it at i saw it it was in the it was in the email it was in the message it was a high explore right here right here large explosive device so um yeah that is uh that's where i got that from so place this under the warden's anomaly and trigger it to be able to quit the planet so i guess let's check that out i think i don't know i'm like i'm like scared because like i want to do that but i'm also kind of curious the reason i'm curious is if we go to our messages from the wardens we had one that said it was where was it at the one that said find all 10 if you want to join us use this chip to find hit, hidden 10 keys we left behind on this planet and place them in an extraction capsule so i feel like there's alternate ways to leave i feel like there's the sentinel corp one that has been like constantly screwing us the entire time you know um that says hey blow it up and then i feel like there's this one saying hey uh, because what they did essentially was that um, that device was actually put in place. Um, it was actually, it was this one right here. So orbital drainage defensive device observation long. The device is working as intended and our tests are conclusive. If the ones calling themselves humans ever approach this planet, it will drain their ships of energy and prevent them from communicating. Our pre-supportization, pre pre-supportization, is that the device will effectively reduce their efforts to approach this part of the infitude, leading them to spread elsewhere if they continue to do so. Our calculations are conclusive. This will give us at least a few hundred years of quietude. So basically, they built this to stop us from finding them. And uh, that kind of counteracts from what this other message said, where if we find 10 of these keys, we can join them. You know what I'm saying? So, but I don't know. I don't know. And all I know is that we have a large explosive device and you bet I want to build it. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to build it and see what happens. Uh, I don't know if there's like multiple endings or multiple ways here. I'm not actually sure. Hydration level low. Okay. Um, hold on. Let's just wait. Actually, I have some of this. I, I gathered stuff because I was like, oh man, I need to, um, I need to uh, go explore and do some stuff. So, um, but let's go ahead. Let's make our, let's see, three iridium, a circuit board, a fusion cell. Okay. Okay, so now I need a fusion cell. So three pulsar quartz, osmium, and obsidian. Easy enough. Okay, so I have everything I need to build that bad boy. So we're going to go do that. But before we do that, I'm going to back up my save because I want the ability to come back to where I'm at right now before doing this and um, see if there's any other, like, ways. You know what I'm saying? 
All right, we've made a backup and we're good to go. We're gonna go ahead and blow this bad boy up and see what happens. <laughs> I'm excited. I'm very excited. All right, so we're gonna place this. Now, before we place this, I wanna say something here, just so if you are doing this, you're about to do this, um, maybe back up your save as well. I have, I currently have three hidden achievements right now. I have every achievement except for three, which makes me think that possibly there's three different endings to this game. And I'm gonna speculate by saying that there's three different ways to leave the planet, all of which require the rocket. However, I believe, and this is me, I speculate, I don't know at this point, is one is through the means of blowing this up and going through quote unquote Sentinel Corp, right? Sentinel Corp's letting us leave, so we're leaving through Sentinel Corp, the people who placed us here. The second is through the wardens by doing something and the wardens allowing us to leave or like something of that magnitude because it said placed place the 10 objects in the extraction capsule, which I don't know how we do that because I don't know how to get the keys back. So I don't know how to place all the keys back in that thing. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not sure how that's going to work. Um, and then the third option, which this is speculation, is I bet there's an option for us to leave for ourselves where we just say to heck with everybody else and we do it for ourselves um like as a solo option because it seems like you know there's usually three three kind of options there's like the you know the good guys quote unquote the bad guys quote unquote and then like yourself because you don't need anybody else that's that's kind of what i think but um okay let's see this guy there's that oh my god that is that is a device oh my gosh how far back do i need to be how far back? Uh, do I need to like get out of here, out of here? Like, do I need to be leaving this place? Maybe? Um, let's, let's just, let's just go. <laughs> Because, I mean, we're still exploding here. Uh, oh my. It's getting awfully violent. Oh, now it stopped. Okay. We have, what happens if we go back now? Well, now I want to know. Hold on. Well, I, I'm nosy. I, I want to see what's... Is there, is there still stuff? Can we still go up there? It looks like we still get up there. Let's go look. We got to go see. Okay, what's it look like? Oh, it's blocked off. Oh. Uh okay all right well hey we made it all the way back up here we saw it we did the thing all right now let's get out of here let's go see if we can hit the button now ow crack look at that i eat i'm fixed it's good okay we're back towards the rocket let's see what we have here um if i go in here leave the planet place your fate in the hands of Sen okay see this is definitely saying leave the planet place your fate in the hands of sentinel corp this is saying okay this is definitely an option i don't have any other options right now interesting i want to know what the other options are okay so we can leave the planet then open extraction platform okay so what what 10 keys would i put in here you know what i mean these aren't keys hmm oh i'm curious i want to know so bad. i want to know what my options are so bad uh what is that uh what oh oh my gosh okay so yeah you can find 10 keys so that's what that does the warden key to so there's just random keys randomly placed are you kidding me oh my gosh okay i was just flying by and i was like looking around i was like okay you know what there's got to be something i'm missing something okay all right so now i need to go find ah so if we have put if we put 10 of these keys ah if we put 10 of these keys in the uh, in the thing it will probably give us another option. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I'm gonna look, go ahead and I'm gonna look for more of these things. So 10, oh man, that could be hard. That could be easy. I mean, that thing was bright. <gasps> was it by the golden butterflies? It was by the golden butterflies. Maybe I just need to look for golden butterflies in the wild, you know? Cause I've seen them, like, I've seen them throughout the world. I bet you that's what it is. I bet you if you find golden butterflies, maybe golden frogs. Golden frogs? Golden frogs? I bet you it's the golden butterflies. Okay, hold on. I've seen more golden butterflies. Uh, where have we seen more golden butterflies? I think that's what it is. I think the golden butterflies hold the secret. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. 
Let me keep, let me see if I can find any more. Okay, golden butter. Ah, ha, ha. There's a thing and there's golden butterflies nearby. I'm just saying. I'm just saying there's golden butterflies literally right here, all over the place. And there was a, there was a crate nearby. Maybe, maybe, I don't know. I'm gonna keep looking. <gasps> Here's another one. I don't see any, I don't see any golden butterflies near this one though. This is right next to where my tree farm was. All right, so there's three. Yeah, look at my tree farm. Oh my gosh, so many, there's so many trees in here. Oh my goodness. There's one little couple of golden butterflies right there. Okay, maybe, maybe the golden butterflies aren't the key. I have no idea. I'm just flying around looking for them to randomly spawn in front of me. It seems like there's quite a few, so it shouldn't be too bad. Oh, there's gotta be one on this island. There's gotta be. Maybe? No? <laughs> I haven't found one for a while now. My, my luck has gotten much worse. I found what, three of them? I think I found three of them in like two minutes. And now it's like, <laughs> I can't find any. I think I'm just looking, I don't know. I don't know, I don't know where they're at. They're here, they're here somewhere. And I don't know if there's any rhyme or reason to where they're at. What about in here? This whole pond is like full of golden frogs. Is there nothing? Nothing? Uh, we got a new message received. I'm guessing we probably get a message for each, uh, maybe for each thing that we find. There's gotta be something over here. There's, there's a gold. I just, I feel like the golden butterflies and the frogs are like the giveaways, you know? It's like, hey, you can see the gold in the real life. Now, if you have a thing, you can see the gold in the hidden life, whatever it is, maybe thing. But you know what? I'm completely, I can't find any now. <laughs> There's gotta be one down here. This area looks way too cool to not have a secret hidden golden chest somewhere. Look at all these golden frogs. Nothing, nothing by the golden frogs. All right, my luck is gone. It has gotten much worse. Oh, hold on. There's some golden frogs over here. Maybe the golden frogs are just, they're just ploys. They're just, they're just, uh, they're, they're fakes. Oh, and there's a storm. The game hates me. It's like, you know, I know you're looking for something, but let me see if I can just mess up your vision just a little bit. <laughs> oh, here's one. There was one on an island. It just was on the other island that I wasn't on. I checked that island over there, not this one right here. Oh, okay, all right. So we're at one, two, three, four, four six more. <laughs> oh, here's one. Ha <laughs> ha. I almost didn't even see this one because it was kind of blended in with the, the, the sand. Okay. It's also up there out of the way. I've been looking like down here with this stuff. So maybe that's my problem. I'm kind of like, I don't know. They're literally anywhere. <gasps> here's another one. Oh my gosh, it's right next to one of my drills. Uh, four, five, six. Oh, we're getting close. You know what? There's got to be one down here in the middle of the crater. Like, if I was going to guess, there's got to be something. I could be wrong. <laughs> uh, okay, that's seven. Thanks, golden boys. Look at you guys. You guys are so cool. I love the golden things. All right, so I've been looking for a little while, and guess what? There's a map. <laughs> I didn't know Planet Crafter had a map. So there's a map. I'll have a link down below to it if you want to check it out. Now, you spoil the warning. Use it carefully because it might ruin your exploration experience. But I did not know there was a map. Um, I went and looked around on the Discord. I was like, you know what? I was like, I gotta find. Because I only need, uh, I have seven. I need three more. Um, and it's not easy finding them. So uh, yeah, we're going to use the map. There's a map. And there should be, let's see, where am I at right now? There should be one right in, right here. Uh, it doesn't show where I'm at but it's, it should be like right over here somewhere. So uh, the map saves lives. It saves time, which could save lives. You know, I mean, it, it could be. <laughs> okay, let's see. I think it's a right. Yep, there it is. Oh my gosh, a time saver for sure. That is eight. We only need two more. Now it looks like there's another one right next to this giant, like uh, the space station, crash space station right here, like right in the middle of it. I don't know if there's a little tiny island or something, maybe. In the middle of it, but it looks like there's a, a crate right there as well. There's my little, there's a little fish pond over there. Yeah, it's got to be on this island right here. No way. And there she is. Okay, so I think we only need one more. Three, six, nine. Okay, perfect. Oh, one more. We're good to go. All right, I think there's one more like right here. 
and it's right next to our base so we're good we're gonna grab this and we're gonna throw all 10 into the ship and we're gonna see if we have another option to leave all right where are you at oh <laughs> yes indeed okay so that's 10. now we've gotten a bunch of messages as, as well so let's go see what our messages are from i don't know if our messages would be from wardens or if they would be from i don't know who they'd be from maybe the sentinel court maybe they're like hey how come you haven't taken off yet what you, what you doing you know they're trying to check in on us they want to steal me and have me go to another planet and work for them for free and slave labor terrible terrible stuff all right uh, we've got a message from oh sentinel corp our monitoring indicates the anomaly has been successfully destroyed use the departure platform to be extracted from the planet we will then re-examine your sentence based on the various deviations from the rules that can be uh, attributed from you this is not an automated message <laughs> okay um i've conducted a deep scan of the planet and something is off i'm getting strange geological signatures and incoherent topographical data near your location try to get to this place use the bottom left corner of your interface of your interface to find your way around i wonder what's there okay and then from riley hello my friend this will be my last message i'm able to send you i've done all i could but our options are very limited i advise you strongly to not to trust sentinel corp as they have shown multiple times how unfair and oppressive they are they could not care less about you or any other convicts. I managed to contact a smuggler's ship. They're willing to take you on board for 500,000 Terra tokens and five solar quartz. Collect the correct amount of Terra tokens and fill your departure platform inventory with the required quartz to board with them. They are untrustworthy too, and I can't guarantee you anything. Your future is uncertain. And despite, there's the third option. And despite all you went through, what lies ahead might be even harder i would like this to be a happy ending but life is not fair okay hold on so we've got try to get to this place negative 248 42 93 why why did she just now give us that what is the deal with that coordinates okay negative 248 42 93 so we'll try to get to that as well but let me let's do this let's put in hold on okay so wait five solar quartz and 500,000 terror tokens? What are we at terror tokens? We're only at 72,000 though. Um, okay, hold on. So wait, okay. So if I go in here and I place one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, do I get, <gasps> leave the planet, trust that some wardens are still alive and will accept you. Uh, okay, so now the other option is one, two, three, four, five solar quartz. And then I also need, I need 500,000 Terra tokens. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, we gotta figure out what these coordinates are though. Um, yeah, let me see if I can, let me see where I can, let's see if we can find these bad boys. Okay, so it said, hold on, let me, let me get this. Let me see here. It said negative 248. So we're at 284. So we're like, we're close to that. And then it said, 42 and then 93 42 and then 93 okay so we're actually oh wait no 42 is up higher wait 93 do we already pass is it trying to take me under here okay so it's like right here it's right underneath of this rock i think i'm supposed to go down i think it's showing me the entrance to this underground area that's honestly what I'm thinking. I'm thinking it's showing me the entrance to this underground area. Interesting though. Wait, what's this? Where does this cave go? Oh, there's like a, I didn't know there was an underground volcano area. Oh, that's super neat. Okay. I don't know that. I think that, I think that was showing me that there's an underground area yeah because basically it has me coming in from right here okay all right so now we know uh we know our three options so i guess we test the three options um i gotta make five hundred thousand credits though <laughs> let me go back to my base and see if there's a faster way for me to make any more money okay let's see things that are worth money here um oh you know what i've got a lot of production and energy multiplier fuses 
I could go ahead and sell all of those, and that would be worth a lot. Um, yeah, I could sell those, and that that right there is five hundred thousand. Um, probably. I mean, energy ones alone. Yeah, let's see what we can get from these bad boys, shall we? Oh, you know what? Go ahead, launch. Be free. So I'm gonna have to wait for my one of my rockets to get back, and then we're gonna load up with these things because they're worth trade value five thousand, six thousand. So. That's gonna be like a hundred thousand right there. That's not even gonna be close to enough. <laughs> oh, oh no. Okay. Well, you know what we're gonna do? This is what we're gonna do. We're gonna hit it. We are gonna go and we're gonna see what happens. We are gonna leave with. <sighs> Let's see. Who do we try to leave with first? Let's leave with the. I'm just throw some random stuff in here so I can grab these. Put these in my inventory. Okay. We're gonna go and save the game. We're gonna try to leave with the Sentinel Corp first, and we're gonna see what happens. Oh my gosh, here we go. Leave the planet with Sentinel Corp. Oh, that was one of the hidden achievements. I knew it, I knew there was three of them. Oh my gosh. That's cool. Uh, yeah, that's amazing congratulations you, success you successfully terraformed this planet all right now what we will now re-examine your sentence based on the various deviations from worlds that could be attributed to you <laughs> oh my gosh look at the fleet flying up there how cool is that for the moment you'll retain you will retain you in detention in while your case is examined. Okay. So we're just going to be detained. That's pretty cool. Oh, okay. Now let me see. Does it load us right back to right before we took off? Um, yes, it does. Yes, it does indeed. Okay. Um, I guess, should we go ahead and see what should we see what this ending does? Mm. You know what? We're going to save that one for another video because we got to come back. I got to make some money anyways. So what we're going to do is we're going to come back in the next video. We're going to check out the warden ending and we're going to check out the um, we're going to check out the money ending, too, and see how that goes. Oh, my gosh. This is exciting. I'm having a lot of fun with this. I'm really I mean, this is a really good time. And um, yeah, we'll check that out. So first thing next episode, we'll hit that. We'll see what happens with the warden ending. And then we will, um, because the Sentinel ending, if you do nothing and if you don't go out of your way, that's the, that's the only ending you're probably going to see. So the other two endings are the bonus endings. So we'll check those both out in the next episode. Um, but yeah, that's going to end it. Thank you so much for coming out. Hopefully you all had a fantastic time. I had a wonderful time and I'm very excited to check out the last two endings. So hopefully you are too. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already. See you in the next one. Bye everybody.